This is CHS TV News. Good morning, Cathedral. I'm Emma. Let's start off our show with a message from Miss McCabe. It's beginning to feel a lot like Christmas. I saw some snow on the way today. I don't know about you, but it's April and that's not funny. Uh, I would like to extend a special invitation for those girls in grades 9 and 10 to come out for the final tryout tonight for the junior girls soccer team. Now only 11 of you showed up yesterday, that's not enough to field a team. So what we're going to do is we're going to have a special meeting at the end of school. It will start at 3.05, it will be in the forum. I will do a count. And if there are not enough ladies, then unfortunately we will have to fold the team. Uh, we do need to have much more than 11 in order to have uh, a competitive team. And you need to be committed to it. So it can't be, oh, I've got this on Thursday and I can't do this on Wednesday. So if you're committed to four days a week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, you are welcome to come out. Uh, today, as I said, will be the last tryout because the, the first game is on Wednesday of next week. So uh, please do be there with your... Um, Nice woolly wear ready to go. The tryout tonight will be at Woodlands Park at 3.30. And secondly, tomorrow is a PD day. It's a happy day for students and a happier day for teachers. It's just a happy day all around. Um, tomorrow we will still be having our Kinball League running. So those of you who participate in our intramural league, you're welcome to be here at 3 o'clock. And that will run till 4.30. And our elementary league starts at 4.30. So I'm expecting the uh, coaches of the elementary school students to be here uh, tomorrow at 4.30. Uh, if I don't happen to see you, I will take for granted that you're not part of um, of our team and that would be if you did come last week and if you can't come this week I'm okay with that but for those of you who've missed the two weeks in a row thank you so much and we'll try you again next year so have a fantastic day Gail stay warm thanks miss this is a reminder that Our Lady of All Souls Church needs volunteers for their pasta supper this Saturday thank you to the 11 students who have already signed up the church needs 15 volunteers, so if you're interested, sign up outside of the chaplain's office. The bulletin board outside of the chaplain's office is also where you can pick up your instructions for Saturday. Graduates are reminded that they can apply for the Cathedral Student Enterprises bursaries. Multiple $2,500 bursaries are available exclusively for Cathedral and Wilma's Place graduating students. You can pick up an application form from Guidance or the CSE. The application deadline has been extended to next Friday, May 1st. If you have any questions, please speak to Mrs. B. Gregorio or Mrs. Brotherson. If you are interested in pursuing a career in medicine, McMaster University is hosting a two-weekend conference beginning this weekend. If you are interested, explore the website macmeducation.weebly.com or see Mrs. Brotherson ASAP. And now I'll pass it over to Emma and Nikki from the Eco Team. Hey, Gales. The Eco Team wants to raise awareness for the proper disposal of batteries, so we will be having a battery drive starting Monday. The battery drive will last for three weeks, and at the end of each week, classes will be asked to bring their batteries to Ms. Mr. Burr's class, where each battery will be counted. The fifth period class that brings in the most batteries will win a pizza party courtesy of the Eco Team. More info will be coming your way next week. That's all for us, Gales, and back to your anchor. anchor. Thanks, guys. Attention all jazz band members. Please see Mr. Walker today before the end of the day. Are you between the ages of 15 and 18 and looking for summer employment? It's not too late to sign up for the YMCA Summer Jobs Information Seminars. The next seminar will be held on April 29th in the library. Students must, must sign up for this presentation outside of Mr. Nordoff's office. Nominations for next year's Student Council President are now open. Students who think they fit the requirements to be the next Student Council President can pick up a nomination form that is posted out on the Student Council office door. All completed forms must be submitted by Monday. The election for Student Council will take place next Friday, beginning with speeches here live on CHS TV News. The Cathedral Tennis Team will be starting tryouts on Tuesday at Rosedale Tennis Court starting at 4 p.m. Please sign up with Mr. Walker or Mrs. Van Veen. There will be a track and field practice today after school. All athletes interested in participating in long, in long jump and throwing events should attend. 
Practices next week on Monday and Wednesday in preparation for our meet next Thursday at McMaster. Thanks from Coach Ferrasso. Yesterday, the senior boys rugby team opened regular season with a regular season play with a convincing 48 to 0 victory over Burbuff. The boys are back in action today at the Red Hot Rugby Tournament at McMaster University. Good luck, boys. The Gales girls rugby team was back in action yesterday with their first and most likely toughest match of 2015. Despite their inexperience, the team showed great attitude and determination against the defending city champions. Cathedral's perennial favorite, Tashe I Did It My Way Williams, scored two tries while rookie Kiana Can't Touch This Collins Lewis added a third major late in the game. Sarah That's What I Say Day contributed four points on two converts and Sandrine the Bullet Boltez rounded out the score with a beautiful two-pointer in the second half. Unfortunately, despite the great effort and productive offense, our girls fell short against the veteran Braves with a final score of 31 to 21. The girls eagerly look forward to a rematch in the playoffs. The coaches would like to congratulate the girls on their first game and are confident that, this is, that the best is yet to come. And those are all of our announcements for today, Cathedral. Happy birthday goes out to Gabriella El Husini from All Your Friends. Also, happy birthday goes out to Samita Singhal from All Your Friends. Have a great long weekend, Gales, and thanks for watching. And I miss you.